this this slit here okay see that there lads okay is what the pin needs to slide through okay so it needs to go through here until that lines up okay just like that there sometimes you might have this on a tripod or something like that we don't have a tripod so you want to make sure that it's level so you stick a level across it make sure that it's level on the ground and that way everything that you do if you level it up you're pulling it to the same to the same way okay you need to pull this pin out here to let the arm rise up okay and we put the pin back in when we're finished with it as well all right uh, don't open or close this yeah that's for filling the oil and if the oil leaks out then we have problems then we have to get it serviced again all right so we're going to work on half inch so you can see markings here right three eight half three quarter one inch inch and a quarter so on right we're working on a uh, half inch so we're going to put in our back corners into the half inch roof, right this is our inside corners so our inside corners goes on there okay. so we turn this over we can slide that in there that in there and they sit all the way down okay sit all the way down they're not sitting up that way okay if they're up that way they're not they're not held in the right position so make sure they sit all the way down like that on top of the back formers we have a guide as well and it goes from zero to 90 okay zero to 90 here and zero to 90 there right so then we want them looking straight across when we put our pipe in okay we're going to put it in like this. Now, I'm going to take this off to show you. First, what's happening. Okay. There. Okay. For, I can do this, and that starts pumping. Okay. But I have to make sure that this is closed, or it will just release. Alright. So if I do that, see the way it's popped back down? Right, so if I close it, and I pump, it pumps away, okay? Now I'll just keep on going like that, until it holds on its own, right? And I'm just going to put these back. You don't need to do that, you can just put your piece of pipe in the way it is now. I'll just, that was only for demonstration purposes. Okay. So it's in there now, in the right position and all that. I have, I've made sure that this is level, and then I'll put my level on here to make sure that this is level as well. Okay? Especially if you're gonna do two or three bends on the same piece of pipe, you wanna make sure that the two of them are level. If everything is level, you're pulling the same. Okay? And then all I have to do is, I'm gonna watch these sides. So, I'm gonna come over here, and let's, you should all have a look at this. That half inch mark there, and that half inch mark there, okay, are lining up with these zeros. See the zeros? Here and here, okay? So when I start to pump this, I want to pull this to a 90 degree bend. So I'm going to pump it until it gets to a 90 degree bend. So like we did with the copper, we have to do one other thing. What do we do? Because of the elasticity, you can Okay, so I'm just going to pump it until it goes to 90. Oh, the is it? No, 90. 90. Yeah. Okay, so you can see the mark here. On this one is a little bit beyond it, and on this one is nearly exactly at it. Okay. Right. But I, need, I know that I need to go beyond it. Okay, so I'm going to be beyond it on both sides. Okay, just to be sure. So there's one. Two and a half. Okay. I release that now. Okay. And you can see the hydraulic ram pushes back into the piston itself. Right. So I've done two and a half uh, pumps past the 90. 
and it's going to be way too much, okay? Because you want this to be 90 degrees, so way too much, okay? The beauty about the half inch is you have got a little bit of play in it, okay? That's the one that's quite a bit. You try to have one inch. You have any chance. Okay? You need to make sure that you get your square, put it on. Okay? Still needs to go up for. Yes? Second bend then on that, okay? We don't we don't measure first like the copper. You pull your bend and then you take your measurement, okay? So I'm going to show you I'm going to show you what what it's like to take a measurement down here, okay? And then you're going to see how much it's output, right? And after that then you should know how much you need to uh, either take off it. Or add on to it to get the bend right. Okay? Anybody done this before? No. 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 Okay. So it needs to be in the center. So my measurement should be from the center. So I'm going to put that up here. There's the center of my pipe here. Yeah. The center of my pipe is along there. Okay? And it's 90 degrees. I'm going to, I'm going to mark. All right, what, 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 400. Okay? So I'm going to mark down 400. All the way around my pipe. Okay. Then we can go back into the hydraulic well. When I place this back in now, okay. So what will I do here? The U bend or an S bend? Which one? U bend. Okay. So. See the see the center here. The center of that has a little mark on it, and that's where my mark should be in here. Okay, the center of that, the center of that. Yeah, that's to get the 400 center, is it? Center to center, but it's not going to give us exactly 400. In the round, remember, I said I'm going to yeah. measure now 400. Yeah. Okay, when I bend it, it's not going to be 400, it's going to be there's going to be a small difference in it. But you'll see what that difference is, and then you'll know what you have to take off, or you have to add on. Yeah. But I want you to work that out because if you work it out yourselves, you'll be able to do it every time. If you don't work it out, then if I just tell you, you'll just go, Oh, yeah, that's it. Don't worry. But then, then you'll know the whole reason behind it if you work it out yourselves. Okay. Okay. Different for different size pipe? It will be different for different size pipe, yeah. yeah. All right? But it'll be, it should be the same on each bender as well. Okay, so there's a guide hole here that I can put, I can view where that line is, okay, and then put that forward. Okay, when it's forward, check that your guide is in the center of it there again, right? That's level, you want this to be level as well. I'm, not, I'm just going to put, I'll put a level across the two of these. I'm going to do it right now, but I'll put a level across the two of these. Make sure it's something similar to what that is there, just for, the, for now. But I want you to put a level across that and a level across that. Okay? So if I want this to bend like a U, I'll have this coming back towards me. Okay? Because when I pump this, that pipe is going to bend in this way. But if I want it to be shaped like an S, I'll just turn it out away from me. Okay? And then we bend that. This. Again, we go to the 90 degrees. And I've done two and a half pumps last time. So what I'll do is one pump and a half. One and a little bit. Yeah. Okay, I'm just 
spot on on it right now, and that one's a little bit past it, like it was before. Only able to be but it's, it's even gone past it as it is. So, I won't go off this one going forward, okay? I won't go that one all the time. When I get some 90, just do a little bit more. Or even stop bang on at this 90, all right? So if I stop at that 90, perfect. And this one may open up, we'll see now. It did open up, but it still may be a little bit too much. This one is right because I've made sure that this one is right. Okay, so I won't come off this side because I know that this side is right already. Okay, so I'm going to measure off this side. Come down. Okay, so it is going to be too much again. Right, so I'll open that out. relatively close. Okay. So we measured this at what? Uh, okay. <coughs> so we measured at this at 400. If it's 420, what would you do in future? And then and what if it was 440? Right. Right. Four. You'd go the other way, wouldn't you? So that is now from center to center, it's about 15 mil too big. Okay, <coughs> now that's not perfect to the, to the 90, but it's 15 mil too big. So if it's 15 too, too big, right, what would you have to do? Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Okay. So I want you to work that out okay, when you're going to actually do the, do the bands. Yeah. All right? Um, you won't be doing the double band straight away, you'll be doing the single band anyway. Um, so when it comes to it, you know, I need to go. I need to take something off it. But you need to figure out what that is, okay? And when you figure it out, I'll tell you exactly what 